सो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइस टुडे आई टीच यू न्यू स्टाइल ऑफ मोशन ग्राफिक एनिमेशन विदाउट यूजिंग एनी थर्ड पार्टी एड ऑन सी गाइस द एक्स माय मोशन ट्रैकिंग इफेक्ट राइट इट्स रियली सिंपल एंड बेस्ट ट्यूटोरियल फॉर बिगिनर्स सो गाइस नाउ आई टीच यू हाउ आई क्रिएट दिस टाइप ऑफ कंपोजिशन सो स्टॉप एंड गाइस आई शो यू माय रेंडर प्रीव्यू या सी गाइस द एक्स माय रेंडर प्रीव्यू एंड गाइस नाउ स्टॉप हियर क्लिक ऑन हियर and guys i show you my one frame render so guys go to on render and render image check yes see guys that's my final render preview it's looking really good okay so guys close and guys go to on file i create new com new check and guys select your all assets and press delete key so firstly guys click on here and guys bfx and use motion tracking check and guys clear here join check okay so guys now click on here that's my open so guys import your video clip like this that's my video clip and first step guys use this one set screen frame check see guys that's my framing right and guys see that's my prefetch check yeah right okay so guys now next one click on here normalize check and guys see that's my detect feature check guys that's my tracking points and guys now i increase more tracking points so see guys that's my threshold like a uh, 0.2 is good simple yeah and guys next one click on here that's my track check guys i create only simple motion tracking yeah that's my tracking right see that's my some tracking okay so guys now See that's my extra points, and guys, next one I create smooth tracking. So guys, you can delete this extra part. This one I don't like this zigzag effect. So guys, simple delete and press delete key. Yeah, right. See guys, that's my smooth tracking, and guys, see that's my red dot extra part. So guys, go to on one frame. Yeah. Yeah, see guys, that's my red dot. So guys, you can hide this red dot. So shortcut command is Alt press D. Yeah, that's it, guys. Alt D, and guys, now click on here, solve, and guys, focal length and opacity radius check, and solve camera motion check. Yeah, see guys, that's my solve error. It's one point twenty two. It's not correct. So guys, you can refine. so guys see that's my clean up and clean track check and see guys that's my error i like guys increase increase like a this one guys change yeah like a 2.3 is good and guys now press x and delete track yeah and guys see that's my extra part so guys see that's not correct points so you can delete some extra points like this yeah that's it and guys one more time solve camera motion check yes good see guys that's my solve error it's 0.14 it's looking really good okay so guys now go to on screen setup and guys click on here and set background check see guys that's my background and now guys i attach this this one plane on flow So guys, firstly, select your only three points like this, like square, three points, and guys go to on flow check. Yeah, see guys, that's my flow, right? This one, and see guys, that's not made. So guys, you can take uh, this one. That's my middle point, and guys, see that's my set origin check. Yeah, that's it, guys. Right? That's my simple tracking. and guys now you can play yeah see guys that's a motion tracking right so guys i create only simple motion tracking it's not complicated so guys all is good my motion tracking is good and stop guys you can increase this scale size is depending your work so guys go to on layout and guys press zero yeah guys see that's my plane and increase size so guys go to on one frame and select and increase scale size like this and guys see that's my cube and guys i don't need this cube so delete so guys 
go to back and preview check yeah see guys that's my simple motion tracking right it's good okay so guys now my motion tracking is finished now guys you can apply any object and create motion effect and vfx animation so guys stop and guys now i create new collection that's my new collection so like a donuts guys i create donut rotation animation so append guys i have donuts 3d model like this collection select and append yeah right that's my donut and guys select and up guys rotate and increase scale size rotate like this like a minus 90 and increase scale size yeah so guys go to on here so guys press one and attach on this flow so guys scale size like a 10 10 and 10 and guys attach on here like this yeah simple and press zero that's my camera and guys now i increase this scale size this plane so plane scale size increase like this and guys here it's good and press zero yeah so guys now go to back and preview check yeah okay so guys next one this time i apply rotation animation and guys position guys you can apply more objects depending on your work so guys go to on here that's my empty donut go to on here guys you can apply more donuts guys you can download this donuts from my website it's free so like this and collection select and append and guys increase scale size like this and guys same rotation so guys select this one and guys that's my second one so guys you can take rename like a one and like a two so we name like a minus 90 so guys press seven yeah guys go to on here press zero and guys see that's my texture yeah good okay so guys now go to on here render setting guys cycle render divide gpu check and max m256 is good for me and see guys that's a motion blur guys i don't need motion blur motion blur uncheck and go to on film and transparent check and go to on color management and i like standard yeah and guys now next one guys i apply second one third one so guys go to on here so guys i like this one and append so guys collection check so same increase scale size like this and guys now select this one donut so guys see that's my mode change and rotation change like minus 90 and increase scale size okay so guys press one and attach on this flow so attach like this yeah so guys select the second one and attach on this flow yeah good press zero and guys i change position position change yeah press seven and guys go to on here yeah see guys that's my simple composition and guys now i apply light so guys go to on here and i apply environment texture so guys i have sdri environment texture check so i like this one yeah guys strength like a 0 0.8 is good 8 and guys see that's my texture so guys see that's my roughness 0 0.2 is good yeah okay so guys next one i apply this time light see guys that's my default light so delete i like sunlight i like sun and go to an up and guys see that's my light so guys rotate your light like this and guys select your light sunlight so guys go to on here strength one is good angle 20 for more shading smoothness okay so guys all is good and guys click on here preview check yeah much better okay so guys my composition is good and now guys i create rotation and position animation 
so guys go to our back select your all this one torus go to on here and guys press i and guys i create location and rotation animation check so click on here and guys now change position like uh, guys go to like a uh, 300 300 and guys go to on here like this press zero okay here yes and press i and rotation check okay see guys that's my simple road position animation this one right and guys now next one i create rotation animation so guys go to like a 300 frames and select this one so guys see that's my rotation this one rotation and rotation like this yeah like a minus 400 randomly and guys press key check select second one and rotation minus 400 and check and guys select third one and by minus 400 yeah that's it guys and guys go to back camera check and guys play yeah see guys that's my simple rotation animation it's looking really good right see that's my really cool effect okay so guys now you can apply more so guys go to on last and guys select your position select all and guys now change position like this out of frame more and guys go to on here yeah and press i and check so guys why this one that's my rotation all zero zero check second one rotation zero and third one rotation zero yeah simple okay so guys now this time i create simple animation so guys select your keys select this one select first and guys select keys press t and use liner so select your second torus donut press t and use liner and lastly guys select third one and press t and liner check yeah okay so guys my animation is finished now preview check see guys that's my really simple animation right it's looking really good guys you can increase more rotation effect so guys select and like a minus 500 is good 500 and we will check select second one and lastly minus 500 check yeah that's it guys go to on preview one more time yeah this one is also good much better right okay so guys now i show you my one frame render so guys go to on here guys i decrease this max amp because that's my only one frame render render and render image check yeah see guys that's my beautiful composition and beautiful shadow see guys that's my really cool beautiful smooth shadow animation right okay so guys my animation is finished now close and guys go to on render setting guys frame rate use same frame rate guys my video frame rate is 29.97 and output so guys go to on desktop create new folder simple and take any file name so guys go to on here png and rgb alpha check yeah that's it guys that's my simple animation and guys render and render image check okay so guys my work is finished so guys if you like my video please share and please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.